Hello everybody. In this lesson, we are going to use some of the text formulas. Uh, this is the student list. List of students I have, like obviously uh, all the names are out, and these are the names. Okay, you can see these letters are uh, these names are not properly arranged. Like you can see, the letter starts with the small alphabets, okay, and their extra space is also there. Some or names are written in caps lock like upper case and some are in lower case also we want to correct all these things so suppose we want to write everything in upper case we can write upper then we can select this we want to correct this then close bracket this is we have written it as all in upper case we can Simple double click, we will get it. Okay. Similarly, if we want to write everything in a small case, equal to, we can write lower case, lower. Okay. This is the text, this is the name, then this has become lower case. Okay. So, This is in upper case, this is in lower case. You can see. So, but these are not in proper order. We can write what is a proper case. Proper case means when we write the names, okay, it must start with that means first letter of the first letter of every word in the names has to start with capital letter. Then we can write here equal to proper. Then we can select. So you can see A capital and R capital here. So we can double click, everything is okay. It's good to go. Okay. So we have used this upper case, then lower case, then proper case. So what is the trim? Trim means that means we have the extra, you can see extra space has been used here while typing. So trim. Objective is to remove this extra space at the beginning and at the end of the letters or uh, of the names. And if there are also extra spaces within the words, that will also be removed. So we can write trim T trim. Okay, then we can select then close so you can see it is not changing anything it is not making it a, that lower or upper it is just it removed the extra space that was at the beginning okay so it, it remains as usual so then we can also use that trim and proper okay and proper and trim what does it mean that proper means this is the format we want at the same time we don't also want this extra space you can write equal to proper okay then within that we can write trim trim okay you can write trim then we can select this then close bracket now we have to because it is two formula therefore we need to that use double bracket so it has become you can see it has to be two formula one is proper proper another is trim therefore two brackets has to be used at the end okay therefore it is written down we have to see that how many formula that we are using accordingly we have to close the bracket by using the number of formula okay so then trim and proper it is just the reverse in this case what we did we have written proper first then trim so in this case we can write trim first then proper equal to trim then text is proper 
then this one bracket close uh, once again so we have to write another so so now it is okay you can see this is how we can correct the text so we can correct it to we can write in uh, upper case lower case proper case even a trim also trim formula we can also use it can remove extra space and we can also use proper trim and trim and proper we can use that's for the lessons see you in the next one